Hi guys, so today we're going to be using Scratch. Scratch is one of the easiest coding languages. What's a coding language? A coding language, it's a language but for computers. Like us humans, we use languages to communicate, but with computers, it's different. Each language can do different things. Like Scratch, it's a very easy kind of language. And it's one of the easiest. So, let's get started. Hi guys, now we are on the Scratch site. So, here is the URL. It is also going to be in the link in the description below. And uh, yes, there's a lot of things. You can share your project over here and everything. So let's just get started. Okay, here it is. So here is the tutorial and this you could watch uh, yourself at home or anything like that uh, because uh, no spoilers on. Okay. So let's get started with the code. So you, when you enter, you will have this, uh, this, um, this square. And in here, it's the game view. This is where you have the view of the game. And here is the cat, our friend, the character of the actual game. What we call him a sprite. After number two, you have another section over here. And this is where you drag all of the blocks of code here, over here. And last but not least, you have the, this is where you take all of your code blocks or you, where you customize your characters, where you change the sounds, etc., etc. So yeah, yeah, motions, looks, sounds, events, controls, sensing, operators, variables, in my box. So we are going to get started with the when green flag is clicked. This is that when each time you click this flag, it makes something happen. It makes the thing that you put in it happen. After you can also do these that you can't attach, but you can only use them when the game is on. See? And when we now click the flag, nothing's happening because we didn't put any function. A function is a group of code that is into one keyword. A keyword is multiple letters combined into word or word or something. But when you do other things like Unity, by show notes we're going to cover in another video, you need to put these files, these function names, these classes, etc., etc., with a good name. Like to stay organized. So we are going to start to make him go wherever our mouse is pointing to. So here, mouse pointer. So the glider, this, so glider one sends to mouse pointer. This is that the glide over here, the number of the glider is how fast the sprite that you attach this code to is going to go to your mouse. We are going to make him for now the default one. If you want him to go to mouse pointer, and if you want him, to make that to do forever, forever, and forever, press the forever button. Uh, sorry, no, press. Um, drag the forever block and attach it with the glider. 
in the when green flags click. So go, look here, that's forever, which time you click it. So now it's following my mouse, the cat. Sorry, a little bit of glitching. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It works. So now I think we should uh, change the background. So we are going to try to use one of these, one of these backgrounds. What should we use? Mm. Let me find it. We should use the mountain. Now he is in the mountains and he needs a lot of warm fur. So we will make him prepared. So he's going to need a lot of grayish clothes. And we are going to fill him into that color to make it look like he's actually like in a in a very he very like he he's a he's a he's um he's those uh, snow leopards one of the snow leopards so now he is over there and let's just do the same thing for the this other cat Now let's get back to the code. He's over here. So now each time we can make him follow a mouse, etc., etc. Okay. Now he's a little bit lonely. So let's make him a new friend. Let's make ah. He found a bear in the middle of this path. A bear was following him. And he's scared of bears. So this is what he says. So the cat says now, He's scared, but the grizzly bear, he is strong. So what he is gonna do is that he is going to grow. So this is how we do it. So we, we already put that forever, all right? And we, let's now do the, now let's do a sound. Sorry, wrong thing, wrong uh, volume. So now let's make a wind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, let's try to change. Okay, that's great. <coughs> so now let's make that sound. Go to code. Now let's make it with that sound. Play. Sorry, sorry.
So I sort of say, well, Okay, and now we are going to make the bear actually threatening. So he is going to grow. Looks, change size by, uh, let's see how much. Okay, he got bigger, he got bigger, he got bigger. He got very big, wait, 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 wait. wait. Make him go 30. Okay, now we made him shout. Now the, the cat is scared. So the cat is going to shrink. Just one second. Now the cat is going to change its size to minus, sorry, minus 30. And how small is it going to become? Um, hmm. Oh, bear organ. Wait, I forgot to do something. Uh, I think the bear's too, 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 too big. Okay, um, let's change the bear a little bit more. Because I need to at least control his power. I don't want him to become too big. Okay. So now, if once I press the space, the bear, sorry, not space, press J. So now if we press, sorry, if we press five, he is going to grow. How much do you say? Let's see, looks, change size by, size by um, negative 30. And now if we start, record. Um, that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have an idea. Um, where is the cat? Okay, so now we are going to be making the cat when we press this when we are going to be pressing let's say down the down arrow he gets negative 30 and now we'll do when we press the up arrow he is going to change his, um, <clears throat> sorry, he's going to change his size bigger. Like, let's see, 20. Now, if we play, we do this. Bubble, 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 do, do, do. Oh, sorry, it's too big. I mean, it's too small. Now, we are going to do the same thing with him. Okay, good. Now with the bear, we are going to do the same thing. Let's go when I press the one key is going to Okay, so it's by 30. Now, let's see how it works. Whoa. 
Oh yes, you want to be so big? Well, I can be bigger than you. Okay, I think that's good enough. I hope you enjoyed, guys. And bye. Be sure to subscribe and like the video.